Okay. So our next question is asking us what is the exact value for tangent 60? Let's copy down the question. What is the um, value for tangent 60? Okay, since it's asking for tangent 60, and we know 60 is a special angle, so we can create a special triangle with one of its inter angle being 60 degrees okay so that's 60 and that's a right triangle so therefore the other angle will be 30 okay and let's call this ABC and the side is going to be little a little b and little c okay so remember if we come across a question that had the tri right triangle with 30, 60, 90. It always follows a fixed ratio of size. So that's going to be ratio of size. That's going to be A and B and C. It's going to be equal to 1 and U3 and 2. So let's say A is X. So C will be 2X. B will be u 3x. Okay? So, that's the first thing. And the second thing we need to know is whenever we talk about tangent, theta, no matter what degree says that, it's always going to be opposite <coughs> over adjacent. Okay? So, in our case, that will be tangent 60. And we focus on the 60 degree angle, which is B in our case. So the opposite is going to be B. And uh, the adjacent will be A, because we know C is the hypotenuse. So we know B is root 3x, and A is just x. So Tangent 60 is equal to u 3. Okay? Yep. So our answer is correct. Mm. Yep. Or if we look at uh, our junior tutor sensor, uh, he or she is approaching this question by using the uh, unit circle. And yeah, still tangent A is equal to y over x, where y is the um, y coordinate of the point, and x is the x coordinate of the point. So we just need to find 60, and then we use the y coordinate over uh, x coordinate. Uh, let me just copy that down. So. Okay, so that's the x-axis and y-axis, and that's the unit circle, <clears throat> okay? And we only need to find out the coordinate for 60 degrees, okay? So that's 60, and we know from the graph it is 1 over 2 and u3 over 2, okay? And that's the x coordinate and that is the y coordinate and we know tangent a is just equal to y over x which is going to be root 3 over 2 over 1 over 2 okay so it's just going to be equal to root 3 over 2 times 2 which is going to give us root 3 as our answer Okay, yeah, so either way works, you can use the way I showed you here, or you can use 
the unit circle way. I mean, either way, we'll, we'll give you the correct answer, which is U3. So let's leave a comment. Solution is correct. Well done.